That wasn't good. Guys, Steve here with Fibbly TV. Has your dog ever had trouble doing a number two? You know that number two, and I ain't talking about, let me see, what is the number two? I think the number one's a Big Mac, number two, maybe it's a quarter pounder with cheese. Stay tuned, we're gonna walk you through the importance of fiber. On Fit Bully TV, like, subscribe, and share, people. Our dogs have been struggling for the past few days, and I'm gonna tell you why. So, this right here is, uh, oh, I almost stabbed myself, forgive me. Beef chuck riblets. Only $4 at your local Walmart. This has bone, it's got clearly some red meat to it. Fiber, 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 fiber. Our dogs have been eating a ton of grass. I'm talking grass like they goats. Not a good thing, not a bad thing. Oftentimes it means there's a lack of vitamin K, or in some cases, Literally, they might just need to up the fiber. Well, guess what I did? I ain't been feeding them fiber. No blueberries, no strawberries, no spinach, no kale, no green beans, no broccoli, none of that stuff. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna test the theory for one today. So I'm testing it, but for a fact, if the dog is having trouble pooping, just like we do at times, imagine when you go eat fiber, your whole system clears itself, you're like, oh, oh God, yeah, that's so good, thank you, Jesus. So I'm gonna give Cha Cha, Cha Cha now y'all, these beef ribs, or these beef, my bad, beef chuck riblets, and then tonight, making some sweet potato, also good for fiber. See that there? He finna go to work on the ribs. Don't worry, baby, I'm gonna give you some too. So I'm giving a little protein, I'm feeding them. Normally I fast them on Sundays to be clear, so that's why I'm not gonna overdo it. But sweet potatoes, especially if you've got one of the nutrition books, by far another great source of what? Fiber. Blueberries, great source of fiber. Spinach, we know this is fibrous. Kale, fibrous. Broccoli, it's got some fiber to it. No less than three ounces if you're doing fiber in your dog's meal, and realistically, when you're having some trouble, not saying they shouldn't have any blowouts, but steam so you can break the cellulose wall, not on your blueberries, and remember the gut needs fiber. What else do you tie this with, or what else do you add to it? You add both pumpkin, I think I got some pumpkin here. So tonight, we'll do pumpkin, good source of vitamin A, we'll do spinach, blueberries, they'll probably have a little kale, and I'll mash in two sweet potatoes, and I'll top it off with one of my favorite things, as you know, sardines, AKA omega-3s, just to kind of not reset the gut, but fill the gut up with some of the things that's been missing. In 72 hours, they should be eating less grass. Stay tuned, take care of your dogs, people. If your dog's have, having trouble pooping, increase, in my opinion, and based on science, the fiber that the dog needs to help assist in digesting all this meat. Believe it or not, they're carnivores, but that meat sometimes, it hurts. And if you see them out there struggling, look, this one here, this is what they're doing. They get out there like this here. They get out there and doing that thing in there right there, trying to get that thing out their butt. It's a bit of a problem, more fiber. Take care of your dogs, people, as always. Thank you for watching.